This is a poetry reading session featuring my chum, Francis. We're at the, the beach and this is a poem by Elizabeth Alexander called At the Beach. Looking at the photograph is somehow not unbearable. My friend's two dead, one low. On T cells, his white shirt and X ray screened for the virus, which I imagine as a single swimming paisley, a sardine, with serrated fins and a neon spine. I'm on a train thinking about my friends. I'm watching two women talk in sign language. I feel the energy in heft their talk. Generate the weight of the words in the air. The same heft as your presence in this picture. Days the volume of the summer air at the beach. Did you tea dance that day? Write poems? In the sunlight. Vamp the strangers. There is sun under your skin, like the gold Sula. Found beneath Ajax Black. I celebrate. Calibrate. <laughs> the weight of your beautiful bones, the weight of your elbow, Merlin, on Daryl's brown. Melvin. <laughs> on on Daryl's brown shoulder. That was absolutely delightful for everyone to hear. <laughs> and now this is the beach by Robert Graves. <clears throat> Louder than gulls, the little children scream. Am I reading that bit? No, 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 that's just a note to myself oh, outside. I'm so sorry. Okay. I'm gonna start again. I'm sorry. Okay, we're starting this one again, yeah? <laughs> sorry. <laughs> the Beach by Robert Graves. Louder than gulls, the little children scream. Who fathers haul into the... Jovial. Jovial foam. <laughs> But obviously, others fearlessly rush in, breast high, laughing the salty water from their mouths. Heroes of the nursery. The is that, that's like horny? Yeah. the horny boatman who has seen whales and flying fishes who has sailed as far as Demira and the Ivory Coast will warn them when they crowd to hear his tales. That every ocean smells alike of... Tar. Tar, sorry. That's... Yay! I hope you enjoyed that, everyone. We're at the beach. Bye!